to my Jewish friends around the world who are scared, and to my non-Jewish friends around the world who are listening. Dear Jewish family, brothers and sisters, it's scary out there. It's really scary. People don't understand that this is not a war between Israel and Hamas. People who are not Jewish do not understand that this is a war against Jews, that the Hamas and the brainwashing of the Hamas and the Hezbollah and Boko Haram and ISIS and all the radical Islamic fundamentalist groups preach hatred towards anyone, anyone who doesn't subscribe to their way of thinking. And the Jews are the first in line. It's terrifying. It's okay to be scared. We're all scared. And I hope my non-Jewish friends are listening to, to me when I say this to you, my Jewish friends. Be brave. Stand up. Be vocal. People are writing to me and saying, I don't have the guts to post stuff on LinkedIn. I don't have the courage to post things on Facebook and Twitter. I'm looking for a job. If you don't stand up for yourself right now, if you don't stand up for yourself right now, vocally, loudly, and proudly, and say that what is going on is wrong, stand with me like I have stood with you, then you're not going to get anyone standing up for you. I know this sounds harsh. I know how difficult it is. I've lived abroad, but you must do this and you must tell your friends to do this and you must ask your non-Jewish friends to do this, to stand up with you. Don't be scared. And to my non-Jewish friends who are watching this, I thank you for your support. You've been writing messages to me. I haven't even had time to respond to you. But let me tell you something. If there's two things that you could do today, it's to reach out to your Jewish friends because the war is coming outside of Israel now. Jewish people are going to be killed in the streets around the world. Make no mistake. Reach out to them and check in to see how they're doing. Please, I implore you. And just as importantly, even if it's not within your nature, be proactive and stand up for your Jewish brothers and sisters in your societies, in your neighborhoods, in your communities, stand up for them proactively. Don't wait. Don't share stuff that they're sharing. Don't just say, how can I help? How you can help is you can speak up for them because they are scared and they are terrified because there are around 2 billion Muslims in the world who might be wonderful people, but a big, big, big portion of them have bought into the propaganda of hatred by radical Islam against the Jewish people. The Jewish people. Not Israel only, the Jewish people. So please stand with them, be brave, give them your back. Because in Nazi Germany, people didn't stand up for them. And you saw the pictures, you've been seeing the videos. This is on the same line as what they did. Would you have stood up for the Jewish people then? Or would you have been afraid to? Because you're trying to get a job. Jewish people and non-Jewish people. Stand up for the Jewish people. Say that I stand with the Jewish people. And if you don't, think about who you are. This is not against Muslims. This is not against Palestinians. This is against radical Islamic fundamentalism. And this is for humanity, which is not restricted to the Jewish people only. It's your humanity at stake.